stay away for too long. Don't go to bed. I'll make a cup of coffee. Children, how are you all? Now you all are with Miss Fatima with her story time. Do you know which story I am going to read today? Do you have any guess? Let's begin. I found a frog. Even though I have grandchildren of my own, it seems like it was only yesterday when I returned home from school to find a frog in my bedroom. My mother just chuckled when I yelled out, I found a frog on my bed. Now, she knew that I would eventually find one but she let me discover a wonder of nature that many people miss. You see? A little earlier that spring, when I was six years old, I saw some little black fish in a pond. Since I did not have any pets, I went home and asked my mother if I could have one. After we talked and about my catching some of the fish I saw and the responsibility of having a pet, she agreed. She gave me a bowl told me to go to catch a few and said that while I was out she would prepare their new home off I went. There were so many that they were easy to catch. I filled the bowl and ran home. When I got home my mother had an old fish bowl filled with water sitting on the corner of my desk. She asked to see the fish looked and with a big smile said Ted Balls Wow you are in for a surprise I asked what she meant and she just said that I would have to wait and see but to watch my fish carefully after a few weeks I noticed some work changing Mom I yelled with excitement come here my fish are growing legs she came into my room looked smiled and told me to keep watching after several more weeks there were more changes mom i yelled with excitement come here my fish are growing front legs and their tail is going away she came into my room looked smiled and told me to keep watching a week or so later when i got up i was amazed there were more changes. My fish did not have tails. Their legs were bigger and they did not look like the little black fish I had caught earlier in the spring. Mom, I yelled with excitement. Come here, my fish are really different. She came into my room, looked, smiled and told me that a surprise was very close. That day, when I returned home from school, is when I yelled out, I found a frog on my bed. Surprise! yelled mom. You watch a miracle right before your eyes. A fish changed into a frog. Now you had a better catch and take him and the other almost frogs back to the pond. I don't need 50 more surprises. Tomorrow morning, off I went. I hope you all will enjoy this beautiful story children. See you again with another beautiful story. Until that stay safe. Take care. Bye bye.